everyone. Welcome to the Restaurant Show. And we are out here in beautiful Beaufort at the Sea Eagle Market with Captain Craig Reeves. How are you? Good morning, Orkin. Doing well. All right. Um, we're actually featuring today the Scottish salmon. Yes, ma'am. Is that correct? Mm -hmm. It's beautiful. Thank it's really you. beautiful. Can you tell us a little bit about it? Because I just love, I mean, I love the fat. Yeah. <laughs> it's and, so good. And that's what makes Scottish salmon different than the Chilean or even the Canadian. Okay. Uh, the fat content is it. fed with uh, natural. It's ranched. Uh, okay. You know, the term yeah. farmed, but this is really ranched. It's fed with all natural ingredients. Oh, uh, beautiful. So it's it's one of our best sellers. People right. love this salmon. Right. And what we're talking about with the, is it is right here, right? That's going to, as you cook it, it really just melts into mm -hmm. that salmon and it's just absolutely beautiful. Now, um, you guys actually cut that. You can get a whole one here. Right. Tell us about how you can get the salmon. Well, we do have them whole on the line okay. and then we can steak them, which would have the center bone in. Okay. A lot yeah. of people like them staked on the grill. Right, right. Or it could come filleted. And we'll do that um, when you come in the store. Right. I actually was here, last time I was here, there was a woman who was coming in for a birthday party. Mm -hmm. And she got like four huge plays of salmon. Right. And I thought, oh my gosh, how is she going to get that cut? And they cut everything for her too. Absolutely. In the, in yeah. the exact size steaks that she wanted yep. to serve every single person. That's right. And they were like, <laughs> it was big. But you're going to show us here how to um, use one of the great, actually, salsas that you guys have mm -hmm. in store, right? Yeah, and that's... Uh, Ted uh, Baker is our salsa guy. He Love makes it. this pineapple habanero. We do a strawberry habanero oh and then gosh, a, look at a that. peach habanero as well. Um, so those are, are great on Different. seafood, but they're yeah. great on pork, steak. Um, we're going to be using them on our chicken wings for competition. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Um, and one of the girls was saying that she's going to do it for her Easter ham. Mm -hmm. She's already right. done it. She put it like on a ham steak, put oh, it in a cast iron skillet. It's very good. Awesome. The pineapple habanero is a great combination. Fantastic. So what we're going to do today is we're actually going to put it on salmon right salmon, now, right? Salmon, right. Beautiful. So I'm just going to take a small cut here. And this is a is a um, scale still on? Or you we guys we went ahead and scaled. This. Perfect. Okay. So it's ready. I, I love to crisp up the skin. Yeah. The skin is another place where the fat is, is carried through on the outside. Right. So, so. They, they clean it all up here for you. Mm -hmm. And again, you leave it skin on. Some people, if you don't want skin on, can you we, take it oh off? Oh, yeah. Of them? We can absolutely skin Beautiful. it for you. Beautiful. And I love this uh, Himalayan sea salt. Yes. Oh, yeah. So Definitely. just real simple salt and pepper. Lemon pepper would be fine. If you'd like. Now, you're not seasoning the skin side, though. You're mm -hmm. not worried. OK, perfect, um, perfect. A lot of times, if it sticks to your pan or whatever, you can scrape it off and then season or yeah. already have it skinned and oh, do yeah. both sides. But I'm just going to season the one and side. And now, this is that salsa you were talking mm -hmm. about, right? You, oh, look at those chunky pieces. That's yeah. that's not processed. That is like, <laughs> that's did homemade. everything by hand. That's yeah. homemade from the get-go. <laughs> I get -go. love that. I love that. And what I do is I, I'll start the, the salmon skin side down. Right, okay. And then when I flip it over, you kind of caramelize the, uh, all the, the stuff there. And this is there. what we have here. Now, so you're suggesting this might be in um, a pan that you might want, not on the grill necessarily. Mm -hmm. Although I know we both like to cook on the grill. So For sure. But this one we're going to do in the pan. Which I like doing it in yeah. the skillet because you can keep spooning over. That, oh, uh, yeah. The, all you need is a little butter. Okay. And just cook it on like medium heat. Okay. And again, you just finish it up. It can be done in the oven as well. Right, right, right. Absolutely. Now that's something my girls like to cook salmon a lot and I feel safer with them cooking with the mm -hmm. oven. I think. <laughs> we'll knock on wood. We'll see. <laughs> but so this is the salmon here. And again, you said, let's, let's go plate that baby yeah, up. That, that looks out. awesome. And I love how you, well, like you were saying there's all that caramelization mm -hmm. on the outside. Yeah, it's almost like candy right yeah. there. Yeah. Oh, that's good stuff. Oh, yeah. Oh, let's scrape all that on there. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> so that is beautiful. And you know, with Fridays now, it's, you know, before Easter. Right. I bet you are busy, busy, busy the, on Thursday the, and Fridays. The 40 days uh, with Lent. Right. Um, so for sure, Friday is Fish Friday now. And how early are people coming to your door? Because I oh. know you're out at probably 3 o'clock in the morning. Oh, I'm sleeping good are at you, 3 yeah. o'clock. <laughs> But no, we, we open at 10, so okay. uh, about 9 o'clock we get busy. <laughs> yeah, definitely. And what kind of fish are you seeing that people are really, um, that they really, uh, that is really popular on Friday for fish fry? Well, mm -hmm. you know, with the, uh, with the Lent season, a lot of times you're pulling in people that don't normally necessarily eat uh, fish religiously, yeah, let's absolutely. say. Yeah, absolutely. So uh, salmon is a great choice. It's right. a, it's a pretty safe choice yes. that um, it's And it's simple. mild flavored. Yes. Mild. 
So salmon is, is one of our most popular fish right okay. now, but grouper, right. uh, mahi, okay. uh, all of our fish are doing well. Uh, yeah, because it is it is right. And then of course you also have shrimp and oysters and everything else that you can possibly imagine. Yes, um, your, your seafood display is absolutely beautiful. So well, thank you. Um, and then again, they, everyone can wrap everything that you need. Everything's good to go. And whether you want it filleted, cleaned up, you, you guys are ready to do it. We'll take care of you. <laughs> and then also, these great salsas, again, are also available. And you have other things, too, right. in this the store. Is, this is one that's really, really good um, on salmon. That's a sea eagle product. But it's Vidalia onion with peach or oh, Vidalia onion with Florida oranges. Gotcha. So it's uh, so, very, very good on salmon. And I also noticed up in the front there, you also have, I mean, you can't walk out of here and not be prepared to cook. You have the foil up there. Yep. You have, I mean, you have every, you have the seasonings, the foil, the sauce, everything that you possibly could need. And they can help you out with the, with the recipes too, sure, right? Yeah. Love and it. that's, um, since you mentioned foil, you could wrap this, put a, a little dab of butter, wrap it in foil, throw it in the oven, 350, 20 minutes. And done. Come back and done. Open it you back up again. To, yeah, just real simple. It's that fanciness, you know, yeah. of like, or how they, at the restaurants they put parchment paper. Yeah. Same thing, right? So, exactly. <laughs> well, thank you so much, Craig, for sharing all this with us. Making sure you guys are getting there early on Fridays and Easter's right around the corner, so make sure you, uh, and call ahead if you have a special request, right? Absolutely. Wonderful, thank you so much. All right, thank and you. And we will be back in just a moment.